It's hard to imagine how many hats the Queen has worn to the races over the years. Many of them have been handmade by Freddie Fox. He first started to make hats for Her Majesty to go with the outfits of Hardy Amis, her long-time couturier. She has very good, even proportions, and better than that, of course, she goes places. Mm. You know, there is a hat every day, and it's really nice having a customer that is wearing things that you're happy with, uh, and everybody's seeing it. It's, it's lovely to have somebody like that. There are hundreds of designs to choose from in his London showroom, but he does have a royal favourite. In 34 years, there have been a lot of hats down the line, but I think probably the most memorable hat from my point of view and everybody else's point of view was her silver jubilee hat, the, right. the pink hat with the bells, which is in the museum now in Kensington Palace. She has tend to let the fashion as well, where that she's had like little um, head pieces and, and sort of like little cloches and then onto bigger brims. And she doesn't wear a very large brim, I've always noticed that. Large brims are difficult for Her Majesty because getting in and out of a car, as I've had explained to me, hold your handbag, get out gracefully, be photographed, be given a bouquet, shake hands. You really have to have your hands free to be able to manipulate, so you, it's forget about it. This is a very interesting shape here, Freddie. I've seen that before. This one, I have uh, made a version of this for the Queen, and uh, somebody has already copied it. It's already out in the market somewhere. This is beautiful here. It's so soft that's, and light. That's for your third or fourth wedding. Right. You could probably have a go Am at I the know, first one. to the second, so. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> It's See, I did that with a view of getting the light through the brim. It's very so light. That, even oh, though. it is, yeah, yeah. yeah. This, this is like something Joan Collins would wear. This is really a trouser hat. Mm -hmm. uh, hats really are wonderful. They change the whole person. They, you can be anything in a hat. You can be a cowboy, you can be seductive, you can be glamorous, you can be low-key. And so the market is there, the hats are there, and you can find them all over the place. Mm -hmm.